When creating parts, you'll often find your feature tree gets very large. And you may realize that back up here in one of your first or second or third features, you've made a mistake or wish to change something. I can click on it and choose to edit the sketch and edit the feature. But when I do, SolidWorks will check all of the features afterwards to see if it has an effect. To stop this from happening so you can make your changes quicker, you can move your mouse down to the line below the last feature. You'll get the picture of the fingers pinching the line. Click and hold and drag your line up to where you wish to do your edit. All the features below will now be suppressed. We can make our changes, update them, and then slide the line back down and see if it has an effect on features. The other thing you may wish to do is to reorganize the order of your features. To reorganize the order of the features, just click and hold and drag it up and drop it in the new location. SolidWorks will not allow you to reorganize features in a way that would upset the parent and child relationships. So if I try and move my linear pattern, it won't allow it. 